Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. The International Agency for Research on Cancer IARC, has classified titanium dioxide as possibly carcinogenic to humans, based on studies that showed increased lung tumors in rats associated with titanium dioxide inhalation. Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. Foods with titanium dioxide are typically candies, pastries, chewing gum, coffee creamers, chocolates, and cake decorations. Although there are some safety concerns, titanium dioxide is generally recognized as safe by the FDA. Make your mark, take our lead. Titanium dioxide albeit FDA approved, but only in very small amounts, less than 1% of the formulation, health advocates blame this colorant for side effects such as allergies, stomach cancer, autoimmune disorder, and organ toxicity. Make your mark, take our lead. One of the causes of implant failure can be attributed to allergic reactions to titanium. There have been reports of hypersensitive reactions such as erythema, urticaria, eczema, swelling, pain, necrosis, and bone loss due to titanium dental implants 15, 67, 68. Take our lead. Titanium dioxide is safe to use, and the FDA provides strict guidance on how much can be used in food. The amount of food-grade titanium dioxide that is used is extremely small. The FDA has set a limit of 1% titanium dioxide for food. Titanium dioxide has similar uses in non-food products. Take our lead. There is evidence that titanium dioxide nanoparticles can be inhaled by some mammals, possibly even humans, and that ultra-fine particles are more toxic than larger particles. Nano-sized titanium dioxide can irritate the lining of the lungs and may cause enough injury to trigger a cancer-like response. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.